Have you ever seen a baby cry? Like really watched a baby cry? You see her arch her back and her face is open wide and her mouth is open wide and her lungs and her belly are fully expanded with breath. Her heart and her body and her breath and her voice are fully connected 100% in the room. She is speaking truth to power. She is not holding back. She is telling it like it is. Her intention and her focus are spot on. She is not shying away from what she knows she wants to say. That's what I want for you. That's how I want you to speak every time. That fully embodied, that fully connected to your breath and your voice and your heart and your body. And that's how it happens. That's how it happens, the undoing. We tell our stories. We say the things we're not supposed to say. And then we open a door for someone else to tell their story. And slowly, slowly, we pull apart the threads. We pull apart the threads of the knot, the knot, and we untie the knot that keeps us silent and alone. I discovered that my story of silence was part of a much bigger story of women and silence, women and speaking. And that in fact there were generations of women standing behind me and beside me who I was speaking with and in some cases for. I discovered the transformative power of speaking. And I discovered the responsibility of speaking. I needed to speak, not just for my own liberation, but for the liberation of all women, for the liberation of all people. Every voice that comes out of hiding, every voice that comes out of hiding contributes to that story of liberation, to the liberation of all of us. So as it turns out, I did have something to say. And right in the middle, right in the middle of the deepest, deepest wound was the most glorious, stunning treasure. And right in the middle of that big, empty talk bubble was the thing I had to stay, my story. When you show up on stage that connected to yourself, that connected to your breath and your body and your heart and your voice, that's when people lean in. They say, who's that? I want what she's having. I'm following her. When you speak from that place, that's when you move audiences to action. That's when real human to human, heart to heart connection happens. And with that kind of connection, anything, I mean anything, is possible. Story creates a container in which we can bear what feels unbearable. It helps us find our place in the world. And when we come to the stage and speak our story, we actually get to reframe the story and step into a new version of ourselves. And we get to rewrite the big story of what's possible for women the big story of women, of who we are and who we get to be. So I call you tonight. I call on you tonight to tell a story. And tell a hard one. Tell the one you've been keeping under wraps. We are edge walkers here tonight. So tell the one that takes you to the edge. And I promise you, I promise you that for someone, it will be a long, cool drink of water. <laughs>